I hope your front door is locked and your phone is switched off. It's match time, and nothing can come in the way of a head coach and his blood bowl. Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to the Sage Streaming Blood Bowl 2. Hello. We've got a game. Yes, I do feel filthy eczema beard. <laughs> We've got a game in the Crindor League in the Nerd Bowl Cup. Um, it is. Hey, thank you, Mike. 18 months. So nice. And Valken of Astra, thanks for the follow. So, um,. In this league, we are currently in fourth place with a record of only 4 slash 2 slash 2. We do, however, have a lot of touchdowns because <laughs> uh, I made 28 touchdowns in eight games. That is a lot. Uh, I've suffered 10 of them, though. So uh, we are playing as the uh, Holy Jesus, who are currently missing their rat over and their thrower. We had a bit of a rough match last game so that leaves us with 10 players plus a journey rat so 12 70. we have a mighty blow tackle a mighty blow on the storm vermin we have an agility bludge leap gutter a wrestle strip ball gutter and a wrestle dauntless one mike here has minus movement uh, should be replaced at some point but i like having bench and i like having four gutters so for now we'll stick around uh, and we have kick on vortica we are playing against Kislev. Kislev goes by Bardic Hero. Two catchers with dodge, two blitzers with dodge, a kick, a block, piling on on the lineman. That's interesting. And a block on another lineman. Yeah, it's uh, it's quite common, uh, Valken, to have uh, one game a week for uh, uh, scheduled leagues. I don't play in ladders much, so uh, this, uh, these things are more long-term things having like 9, 10, 11, 12 games in round robin with, uh, well, actually, usually 9, 11, or 13, um, because you have even number of teams. Um, have it, having uh, a round robin stage and a playoff stage with one game a week is quite common. Some even have uh, one game every two weeks. Yep. Well, welcome to the best way to experience the game. Uh, you can play in ladders, uh, you can have random matchups, but the uh, scheduled play typically means you need to play the correct opponent at the correct moment in time. So you can't just say, I'm going to sit down and play. You have to actually uh, figure out together uh, when it, it is convenient for both of you, which is especially complicated with uh, cross-continental play. This looks like sweltering heat to me. This is not Kerbal Space Program, no. We're gonna kick first. Yes, indeed, it is sweltering heat. So that's going to be interesting. No frenzy, no sure hands. No sure hands for him either, and I have strip ball, so that's kind of cool. Uh, we have the mighty blow. We also have tackle, which helps. <laughs> well, I'm I'm glad you stuck around to watch uh, Kerbal, even though you don't really know the game that well yet. It's uh, it. Uh, wait, you actually you actually started playing this, or am I now confused? No. I'm sorry, Hercules. You did watch the Kerbal, but it was someone else who started playing it because of the streams, right? I think that the other person also had BB in their username, which I, oh, you did, okay, sorry. I, uh, I get confused sometimes. Let's uh, go deep. Yeah, that's not that deep. Then again, it is blitzable. All right, catcher holding the ball now. Oh, wow. Well, welcome back to it. 
Um, if you uh, if you feel like you're relatively new to the game, then uh, the Reddit Rookie League, especially if you're new to online play, um, this is probably the best place to uh, to get into the multiplayer scene. I didn't actually check the star player points on my dudes. This one merely got stunned. This guy's on three. This guy's on zero. So doesn't really matter. Right now he is in blitzing range, but not easily. Ah, nice. Stuns are okay. We can live with stuns. Well, it looks like he's coming in here then. <sighs> ah, someone to punch. The Rat Hoker got MNG. No, he got minus agility. Uh, last game, so he'll be back. Merely a push here. I suspect he's going to follow that up. Yes. Because diving tackle, good for that. This one he does get down. Merely a stun. Since we don't have guard targeting, this is pretty hard. Hmm. He doesn't have tackle, so going there is quite okay. Getting out the way here first. Both down will do. I missed what he said in chat. Punching here, two die. Put him there, do not follow. Well, it's still uh, agility two is not something you typically want to dodge with, but it's better than agility one. Yeah, I was gonna reply. Dodge protecting us here, that's lovely. And if we are going to see a... Uh, a gutter uh, targeted, then I'd like it to be Mike. Sorry, Mike. Two, four, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Just enough to get the surf. So we could stick our Jelly 5 in here with two GFIs and then blitz there, surf there. Unless he gets, no, he set this up, right? Yeah.
But then we'd get our Agility 5 served as well. Not sure I want, want to sacrifice that here. I think I don't want that, no. I think I don't. Week. Now it would be lovely to get a punch in here. But honestly, I don't think that's going to happen. So right now, this is a one die. And if we make that block later, it could be a two die. Let's let's see if we can make that happen. So this guy's got blodged, that's fine. <laughs> but simply getting this one up makes this two die block. Uh, we don't need Dauntless, you get. And that removes this counter. No, we need to actually follow that to <coughs> remove this anti-assist, which makes this to die with block. Yes, he doesn't have block. Oh, got him. Nice. Hey there, hybrid. Um, not that much happened. I mean, we're on turn two. I kicked. I did not receive. And um, yeah, looking pretty promising here so far. Just got a sweet removal on one of his two catchers. <laughs> Maybe. He's on 28, so he's getting there. He's on 15, so he's very close. He's okay. Just stunned. So far, he's been breaking armor a lot, but not really getting results for it. So that's good for us. There's the wrestle strip ball getting punched. Only two dice, just a push. This guy could technically score with two GFIs and a leap and a dodge. Some risk involved, of course. Oh yeah, like that's going to stop me. Haha. <laughs> yeah, you could jump there and dodge there. Boink. Enjoy it while you still have a catcher, dude. Yep. So let's see what the heat does then. I'm missing two and he's missing three, including a large blitzer. Hmm, 
What was it? Eight games? Do we mind? Is anyone in chat also in this league? And can you tell me how um, how many people go to playoffs? Because right now I'm in fourth place. Ooh. Use the Jelly 5 as a retriever for now. Sure. Dauntless doesn't actually matter here right now. Bit lucky on that one. He's on 28, yeah. He's on 15. Would be lovely if we could scale them both. That classic Skaven clipping. Sure, let's push a little bit. That's the furthest he can reach, really. matter that much. Something like that. <clears throat> uh, I made a nice cast, but uh, Heat is doing the Heat things. Blodger or Dodgers or anyway. Oh, thank you, Rata. Should be slightly better now. Right, so this guy is a nice target.
That's the GFI I don't want to take. Let's try with this one. No. Like that. Yeah, like that. Exactly. Thank you. Can't really step on that. Just got jump up, but nothing to do with it really. Good. So past now would be a bit scary, but skilling this guy would be really, really, really lovely. So let's just give that a go then. Catch on the three. Yes. Didn't even blitz this turn. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see what the heat does this time. I'm missing two, including my Wrestle Dauntless. He's missing nothing. So it's my nine against his 10. We do still have kick. Yeah. Let's see if we can get a steal on them. Would love to get another Kaz with uh, Liger, skilling both Storm Vermin in the same game. <clears throat> like uh, a piling on and a claw or something. Oh. Four of his, one of mine. Right, have fun, Falcon. Sadly, not the guy in the back. That would have been lovely. That would have been really, really nice. bit odd he would do the lunar block before his blitz. More free punches. N nearly a push here. So we're definitely blitzing one of these two. Let's just that one. Because then we've also got the assist against these two. That's nice.
Let's see if we can get that. Yeah. Three rerolls, four turns. Yeah, that's the problem. Weak. Dad. Just a push. Okay. And a little bit. Just a push. Right. <coughs> Since he has jump up. This is actually quite a bit of space he's got. We are technically just within reach for strip ball. Okay, fair enough. Not targeting the tackler. That's good. This seems ambitious to the point of folly. Catch fails. And the reroll says catch works. Okay. Crat. Tackle. Oh, he actually went to the tackler. <laughs> Boo. Boo that frog. Okay, at least he's making me work to get my two die. Two, three, four, five, six. That's a two die with wrestle strip ball. I'll do. Yeah, it makes it harder to retrieve if it comes down to him, right? Out, okay, that's good. Forward, that's not bad. Next to that guy is not great, but it's okay. <coughs> Do we chuck it? Okay, that's good. Then 
this one is contributing least to the defense there, I guess. This one's dark and tackle on it. This guy. Hey there, Libio. Now he doesn't have wrestle, he doesn't have tackle, he doesn't have strip ball. So that's good for us. Block doesn't actually matter. That's not a pal. That's not a pal either. Trust in the blodge. Just like he did, except I have strip ball. Stygian going down with his new skill. He's fine. Ish. Fine ish. Where's my other mighty blood? Oh, he's right here. The fact that he's making those other blocks blocks is uh, interesting. Considering any failure there could be the end of uh, everyone. My plus agility does have leap, yes. So we have a two die here. Hmm. I could just score this turn, to be honest. His chance at one turning is not that great, and I can't really make the ball safe. Is there anything I would really like to blitz? Guess I'd like to stay in this guy's way because he's, he's typically a scoring threat. So here it goes. One, two. Let's 
So far, so good. Doesn't matter, really. All right. All right. Since we have a turn left, good time for a blitz, right? Uh, well, the thing is, I have the dodge skill, and um, I have uh, I had a GFI to make. The chance of not winding up using the team reroll before the GFI was an advantage of this approach, if that makes sense. If it wasn't for the GFI, I would have skipped the dodge, yes. Unless there's a riot, this doesn't matter much. Nope. There is not, so it does not. So not losing anyone to the heat is not actually that important. <coughs> it's actually bad. If we'd lost everyone to the heat, then we would have gar be guaranteed to have them back. So yeah, we really need to get Liger a star player point. And I think one of the gutters was also getting close. Falcon, I guess. You broke my no a heart! Boiling on! Yeah, <laughs> that that sounds cool. Can't reach it with the mighty blow. He's got an extra GFI. Yes, please. Boink! Well, <laughs> that was a silly tornado. Fair enough, Librio. Thank you to all of my patrons for helping make this channel possible. Would you like players named after you too? Then you can become a patron via the link below. Well, in my case, since you know my girlfriend, it's not that odd. I don't actually know about Crindor. I know Strippin's girlfriend, but... She's played. Dodger. They actually moved back from the US to the UK, or rather, uh, Strippin moved back, Dodger moved with Strippin to the UK. <clears throat> Having his family around with the kid and stuff. We still get to target the only catcher, so that's good. Oh, 
Oh, we lost three to heat and he lost none. Maybe a quick score would be good. We have one. These are all three gutters. Okay then. Any score would be nice, really. <laughs> Three of my four gutter runners are out right now. All right, let's skill this. Just yet. Good. Bad. Good. Good. Bad. He can't reach. That's okay. Seems fair. That is one adorable ferret, though. I, uh, I understood what you meant, even though I saw it wasn't what you said. But yeah, one gutter runner and no thrower makes the whole let's score touchdowns thing a bit iffy. We can hope that he comes and hunts me and... Yeah, it hasn't helped yet, though. I mean, I got one. That's brave. That makes sense. I mean, he has the numbers for it. So, this guy could blitz all the way up here. I mean, we have leaps, so the diving tackle need not be that much of a problem. No, they're not different distances. It's uh, it's just a different uh, concept of space. Uh, what looks like a square here is actually a circle. That's that was our conclusion in D and D at least. Good point. Good point, John. Hmm. Yeah, I'll accept it anyway. No. Ah, oh, that sound.
So, 3 plus Dodge, 2 GFIs, and a PAL. <coughs> and if he doesn't, we're still in a ton of trouble. Because <laughs> there's basically nothing we can do. I mean, we could hope for the hard catch in the focus boss. That helps. That, not so much. And of course he breaks armor. <sighs> well, I did do that myself. I could have hit one square further if I thought of. doesn't matter that they just catch the ball because this guy broke armor. This guy is uh, unable to get there. I mean, if he fails to pick up twice in a row next turn, that might help. I suppose. <laughs> naughty, naughty bot! I mean, sure, I guess. Better. Nothing. I was hoping to get here to get a one that punch there to get a chance of skilling him, so we'll try that and break our nicks. Nope. Oh, nothing. So basically, we need him to one in nine. Otherwise, we are in trouble. Tackler down. Ooh. That was the piling on that was requested earlier, right? I am ahead in touchdown still. So he can't win by stalling. So he could just score, and then we'll have another drive. I'll be receiving. I'll have nine, eight or nine players, probably. Yeah. You use a blitzer, yeah. Oh well, oh well. A lot of heat. Let's see what the heat does next. So I've got eight and he's got seven.
not too bad. I could try to get a completion with lighter. <coughs> but I don't feel in control enough to do that. <laughs> Alright, that's it. I kick. Lovely. Sure. Didn't actually need darkness here. Nice! Would be two GFIs to get there. Yeah, we're not doing that. Which means this is going to be a one die. These are very, very good KOs, because <clears throat> if this is the last drive, as it should be, these are actually really valuable. That's fine. So now it's eight versus five. Pow against the gutter. Still eight v five. No more dodge. <clears throat> Giving out the free punches here. I'm not in a hurry, I have four turns. I'm quite okay with decimating your team first. Thoughtless works. Knockdown. Not with Fury Rust of that.
Two, four, six, eight. Yeah, fine. Three turns to go. Now, we do have gutters at the front. But if given the option, I'll score with, um, with Liger. That, that, that'll do it. That'll do it. Mr. Piling on. No follow up, so no piling on. There's also get another two die there. That will not do it, however. <laughs> we just leap there. You, on your feet. It's turn 14, so we don't have to move the ball right now. All right, here it goes, guys. The pass is good. That's not the scariest part. Catch is also good. All right, nice. All but one of his players marked. So he'd need a 3 and a 3 and some GFIs for a 1 die. Or a 4 plus dodge in the leap, yes. What? Um, uh, okay. There's no leaks in there, right? Well, it gets him to die on the ball. No, he also broke armor. That means Liger is probably not scoring. That's sad.
Ambitious is a good term for it. Yeah. Well, it works. He's got the ball. So, this is a two die even if Dauntless fails. It also has Wrestle. Wrestle is apparently needed. Use the bounces count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. So on turn 16, I have a chance at a cast with him. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, nine. He definitely can't score. Hmm. Well, that's okay. At least Falcon is getting to 45, which puts him 6 SPP away from skilling. That's like one game. Here comes the jump, little darling. Here comes the jump, I say. It's all right. <clears throat> nice. <sighs> this is turn 16. I very nearly tried to stall. Three, four, five, six. I had almost, I was already counting how far this guy could get or how far that guy could get. Oh, not this one. I was about to put him there. Three, four, five, six, seven. These are really good dice right now. My lizards would not have liked those dice. Yes! That's a skill! <laughs> Both storm vermin skilled up. And we get our Rat Ogre back, so the chance of uh, having some serious damage against whoever's next is pretty good. <laughs> Let's roll another couple of 11s, yeah. I'm uh, I'm sorry, Mike, but you're uh, you're apparently light meat today. It is what it is. Nice <laughs> One one and a six six. I mean, I wouldn't mind the strength in the claw.
<laughs> Gerade in het bakje. Nearly three touchdowns this game, though. Oh no, my movement aid got her, got her got stunned. Piling on does dilly squat. Why did I keep that move busted gutter runner? I currently have a treasury of 60k and I have 12 players. Good enough reason for me. Now I have a treasury of 140k. If we buy this guy... He's one SPP away from Dirty Player. And we just have to... I mean, I like Bench on Skaven. 13 players is a good number for, for Skaven. Can go to 14 if you have a second Dirty Player, maybe. Ah, hell. You can go to 14 with one Dirty Player if you want. <laughs> yeah, so we're keeping him. Oh, he got an MVP. Let's go up. All right. Good stuff. So let's have a look. Does this change anything in the leaderboard? Oh, it puts us on second place. <laughs> That's good. Hadn't really thought about that yet. Five, seven, nine. It's, five, six, six. it's also nine. Uh, the nerd will still have a game to play, though. No, they don't. The elves do, but... <coughs> so, let's see what our storm vermin do. New claw. I could go for two pilings on. I could go for a piling on and a guard. Could go for a piling on and a tackle. Not getting frenzy, because of course the rat over already has that. But I know I'm getting piling on on my tackler. I would not mind considering guard for Liger. But yeah, 13 players. Hi, Calf. Hmm. Well, thanks for uh, for letting me know. I will, at the very least, uh, poke you during break. But in that case, yeah, yeah. In that case, I'll uh, I will switch over to some Kerbal. So, um, I'll be right back. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this, remember to hit the thumbs up button. If you want to see more of my content, then do press the subscribe button and the little bell, and I'll see you around.